I was an amateur. I didn't always hit it as far as I do today. And just like you, I was constantly trying to improve. I chose Titleist then for the same reasons I do now. The new Pro V1 and Pro V1X. Choose the best for your game. Jonas Blick is so close, probably a little bit too far. Uh, yeah, no, it was, um, the, honestly, I haven't been in this position in a while, so it was kind of fun uh, being in it, and um, f felt really comfortable the last four holes, and um, tried to make a run at it, and just didn't happen, so. Um, Walk us through that last putt that you had to make. Um, quite a simple putt, maybe a little longer than I wanted it, but it was just a bad bunker shot, when you just went out a little too much to the left, and um, I thought it was a lot quicker than it was. Yeah. I saw you pretty angry when you missed your bogey putt on the ninth and have a double there. Things looked like they were getting out of control, but that was a spectacular back nine to put yourself back in contention. Yeah, no, absolutely. I, when I doubled that hole, I was like, am I out of this tournament? And um, I bounced back really well and almost made a um, hole in one on 11. It kind of got me going and um, yeah, had a bunch of good looks in the end there. And um, sometimes it works out and today didn't. One of the perks of uh, coming to the Australian Open is you get a chance to qualify and you've made it to the Open Championship at Carnoustie. That's got to feel pretty good. Yeah, that is cool, yeah. yeah I played at, um, in Carnoustie, my British champ, a long time ago and it's quite a golf course. It's a cool golf course to play, so I'm definitely looking forward to that. You're developing quite a lot of good ties with Australia, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, I have a lot of good mates uh, from Australia and I uh, uh, really like it down here. So, um, yeah, I've got three more weeks here, so I'm looking forward to it. Good, man. Congratulations on a great week. Thank you.